This is January the 9th. It's going to get down to 22 degrees tonight by midnight. So we're going to have to try to get out here and get some coons on the outside. Keep them out of the dens. We're sick and tired of that. We got Mac and May. Let's get out here and put them on the wood. Well, the dogs are over a half a mile away. It's 0.65 and they ain't gave a bark or nothing yet. We're driving around to see if we can hear them. Well, we got in here 641 yards. We can't hear the dogs, but it's showing they're treed. They're either in a bulldoze or they're treed. We're gonna walk in there and get them. Right down here to May. Mac is on over the hill. That's what she's got. Another den tree. Another den tree, ain't it, Maymay? Huh? We just got back from that last tree right there, that last den tree. I'm sick and tired of dens. Mac was over the hill from May. There was bulldoze down in there. He was either running to that bulldoze or just running another track, or he could have been running the track up to her. He's young, so... She had a hoe up there in her tree. I showed you that. Pretty sure there's a coon in it. We're about to drop him over the hill here. I would have stayed in there and let Mac finish out what he's doing. I don't like to catch a dog, but we don't know who owns it. The dogs got out of pocket. There wasn't no trespassing signs, so we uh, <laughs> just went ahead and got our dog, didn't we, Luke? That's right. Dog just got struck in 160 yards. There's May. Yeah. Max opened up in there too. See I was gonna go get that gun, Luke. We're gonna get their three right now at 162 yards. There ain't much sounds better than that. I hope they didn't have time to get to a den tree on us. Right there it is, Mac and May's coon. I think we had about nine den trees and we finally seen this. We're gonna hook them up here. Well, the dogs are hammering every breath. They went 411 yards, fell trees, sound a good, good track. We should see some meat here. Hopefully we don't see a hole in the tree. Good girl, good boy. Good girl, May May. Good boy, Mac. Get on that tree, sissy. Good. Right there's your coon. One den so far, two on the outside of me. We finally got the curse broke and I'm glad with these last two trees, uh, we got to see the meat for the dogs here. They was uh, absolutely amped up. You got anything to say, buddy? No, we had a good time. Well, you all, thanks for watching Kentucky Cooner, where there's a little less talk and a lot more action. Until next time, put them on the wood. <laughs>